Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is the Wee Bike Parts update for October 9th, 2023 for the Super Cub C125. Let's get into it. All right, so there are not many of us out here. So if you are into Super Cub content, specifically the C125, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. Just a reminder, to find this information, you'll need to go to the Wee Bike website, then click Motorcycle Parts, then Honda, then 125, then scroll to the bottom of that next section to find the Super Cub, it's close to the bottom. Then when you pull that up, you're gonna to scroll to the bottom of the page for uh, the new stuff, and we're going to be looking at three rear suspensions and an oil cover today. First, we'll start with the Takagawa Oil Filter Cover Kit. It's $42.33 at the time this video is being published. This comes in either silver or black, and it is just basic engine dress up, which I think makes the Cubs look better than the factory looked, but that's definitely a personal subjective decision. Next, we have the Advance Pro Zeta Rear Shock. These are $217.18 and come in a number of configurations. You can go with the standard stock setting or you can opt to have different filling pressures. How this will affect the handling of the bike with the different filling pressures, I'm not really sure to be honest with you. You'll either want to contact Wee Bike or the manufacturer directly for that answer. Uh, I love the color of this rear suspension, but I can't buy a suspension just based on the color. And now we have two options from YSS. We have the Twin Shock Z302 or the E302. The Z series is going to be a more aggressive adjustable shock catering to the enthusiast that wants to dial in their setup. Uh, can also be used for track use. It has a nice clean design with the quality we have come to expect from YSS. The E302 is going to be cheaper and a more subdued version. If you're just looking for a basic upgrade to your factory suspension that's go not going to affect the ride quality too much, this could be a good option for you. And as you'll notice, the E302 comes in at $259.64, while the Z302 is a little bit more expensive and is going to run you $321.46. If anyone has any model of YSS shocks, not just these, but any of them, please leave me a comment saying if you like them or not. I know these are very popular in the Super Cub community and a lot of people seem to have them, so I would just like your opinion. Okay, so that's it for this week. Please like and subscribe for more of this type of content and I greatly appreciate you watching. Please have a great day and stay safe on your Cub.